All right, the reason why we wrap our systems, because even when we don't put fabric on the top, which we do that sometimes, as you guys know, we like the fully contained system in most cases, but in extreme cases, I want at least like a horseshoe shape. And then sometimes we don't do fabric on the top because we just want to move water with literally no interruption whatsoever. So here's what happens when you don't, I mean, besides this all being garbage, I mean, you know, it's ADS pipe from Home Depot, so it's it's garbage. Besides it being garbage, look at that, because there was no wrap, no wrap. So, you know, we see it all. I just want to share it with you guys. So this is why you rent, uh, have to wrap your French drain system, and and it's 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 not like all these these gimmicks that you see. All, all the stuff that just ends up like this and in my dumpster and failing. And you guys always want to know, you know, how we handle the sod. Well, Marcelo and Valentin are working as a team. This stuff is, you know, done in pieces. And, you know, they work around sprinklers. And you can see how just big and thick and heavy each piece is. Because when we cut it with a sod cutter, we cut it as thick as it'll go and we want to remove as much dirt as we possibly can we want to get as much root as we possibly can so you just take a sod cutter put it on its deepest depth and especially these yard drain issues it's usually you know pretty damp which means it's it's going to cut really nice for you they, get, they have this system all buttoned up and they're they're putting in some blind inlets as well and you can see how this is this is is perfect. I mean, just you can't even tell we were here. You know, they're going to take a blower and just you know hit it so that the the grass blades are back to standing. And then you know this here's a good visual for you guys. So that's how the pop-ups look when we're done. So one of these is for roof runoff. The other is for a French drain system. The roof when this goes up and you have leaves and shingle gravel it's just going to end up in the grass and then lawnmower is going to mulch it so that's not a big deal not a big deal you don't even know it was there and it comes comes right out this stuff just comes right out so we have no problems with that and the way we vent and, and put clean outs you know homeowners a lot of times they'll just run a garden hose through you know it's kind of a feel-good thing and then this pipe it wasn't ran right and it held water you know what happens when you, you you leave a pipe holding water the trees sniff it out and they fill it full of roots all right guys until the next video